Rebecca here with Empowering Pumps and Equipment. I have Jeff Bergman here with us today with ABB. And Jeff, why don't you introduce yourself? Hi, everybody. Uh, Jeff Bergman with ABB. I'm the segment manager for the water wastewater effort in the variable frequency drive group for uh, ABB. Uh, glad to see you all are joining us. Thank you, Jeff. So why don't you tell us how you support the water wastewater industry? Wow, what a great question, uh, and very open-ended too. You know, uh, ABB does a lot of things as a manufacturer of products to uh, help uh, the aging infrastructure, to help uh, with the people and the technology, the condition monitoring and those kind of things. We develop products that uh, uh, allow the customer to save energy or facilitate uh, the process, make it easier uh, to automate processes and those kind of things. In the variable frequency drive, we do a lot of things to help uh, reduce water hammer. We do things uh, that allow you to do condition monitoring of your existing motors and pumps in the industry and, and start doing some predictive maintenance kind of thing. So uh, ABB as a whole, we do a lot of different things to help out in the industry, uh, but uh, uh, a lot of it really depends on what the industry is wanting for. We, as I said, we make instrumentation products, we make uh, uh, drives. Uh, we, we make a lot of different things that really help out the industry. So not one thing, we can do a lot of things to help out. Um, so in regards to the water wastewater industry, like you noted, why did you decide to exhibit at WefTech? Oh, you know, we've uh, we've been going to WefTech for quite a while. And in my previous roles, uh, we've always attended WefTech. You know, WefTech is a, it's a great chance for the water wastewater industry to get together and kind of share ideas and, and uh, kind of learn from each other. Uh, you know, you, you have your competitors there. You have uh, other people you work with, people you've known for decades. Uh, who come to the different shows and you get a chance to talk about hearing what they're doing and seeing new things and looking at new products and that. Uh, it's, it's just really an exciting time. Uh, we also use it as the time to have meetings with our reps because they're coming there to the show to meet with their other manufacturers. So it really also gives us a chance to do some networking with our manufacturers reps, our channel to the market, but it gives us a chance to meet with the engineers, the end users, learn and listen from them. What kind of things are they looking for? What things are important to them? Because in, in our industry, it, people do business with people, and you've really got to understand and listen to them to, to figure out what it is that you need to get out of the market. I love that. And, and really, you're right. Um, to be able to have those experiences and those personal interactions is very important. So I know that this year it's going to be virtual for WebTech, but what are you planning to showcase at WebTech Connect? You know, the, this is kind of a, a strange year for a lot of manufacturers. Uh, a lot of us don't have experience in virtual trade shows. Don't, actually, don't, a lot of us don't even have experience in virtual anything. Uh, so we've done a lot of virtual trainings through the uh, year. Uh, we've got a lot of learnings. So this is really our first attempt at this. Uh, we're going to try the uh, virtual WefTech. Uh, we're going to be focusing on a lot of things that our drives do. Uh, one of the things that we've really uh, seen a lot of this year is uh, clog pumps from wipes and, and masks and those kind of things being flushed down the toilets. Uh, some of the things that we uh, manufacture for our VFDs and our uh, soft starters, they have a pump clean feature that rotates the impeller backwards and forwards in a cycle to dislodge those strings and debris. So we're doing a lot of things that will help the infrastructure work better and longer. Uh, condition monitoring on the motors, condition monitoring on the pumps, uh, ramping up and ramping down, things that make the equipment last longer. Those are the kind of things we're going to be focusing on virtually for the drives group. And then our motors group and our instrumentation group are going to be focusing on similar things that help, again, automate the system, make it easier to monitor remotely, which is a big thing we're seeing today with people not being able to go into the office or go into a facility. Uh, remote monitoring and condition monitoring uh, for preventative and predictive maintenance. Awesome. And definitely with the flushable wipes, um, that is a big issue. And it's great to see the things that you guys have been doing there. So I'm excited to see some of that in WebTech Connect. So Jeff, um, last is, what's the best way for people to connect with you? A good question. Uh, I'm available from LinkedIn. Um, also, I can be uh, uh, contacted through my uh, email address, jeff.bergman at us.abb.com. Uh, and again, through LinkedIn uh, or uh, email address uh, is, I'm usually very quick to respond to that. So uh, any of those two formats typically work very well. If I'm on the road, they always give me a, a, something I can look at on my phone. Perfect. Well, Jeff, thank you so much for being here with me today. And I'm really excited to see you showcase at WebTech Connect and everybody will have to make sure to check them out during the show. Yeah, we appreciate everybody spending the time and having a look at what we've got. And uh, thank you for your time today. It's very, very enjoyable. 
and uh, look forward to seeing you at another event face to face if we can do that sometime in the next year. Yes. <laughs> yes, definitely cross our fingers. <laughs> <laughs>